Welcome back. Today we're putting the car back together. Yeah. I'm gonna put a bumper on here. I mean, I've got a little zealous here. Already put some mirrors on. Got the mirrors on. We're gonna put the door panels back on. I'm gonna take some tape off. We're gonna clean this sucker up. We're gonna put this back together. Make this drivable. I need my car back. I also need my Camaro back in here. I need to work on it. I've been yelled at by you guys saying, more Camaro content, yay! We just need to finish this first, so. We're trying to put back together some stuff that we have not put back together. One thing is the windows don't work on the doors. Um, some other things are um, after it was painted, I was putting in this while it was still real wet and we actually tore the paint off. So adhesion is really good. This is really hard to chip off. So I did a good job with the primer and the paint, but this wasn't set. So it's been a few, uh, what would you say? It's been a couple months since we painted this thing. And we still need to sand that out, um, re-coat it, re-clear it, blend it in, and put the strips back on. I gotta paint those things, I forgot. And then we can start cutting and buffing this thing and making it look all super nice. Isn't that right, Johnny? Yes, boy! We're gonna go ahead and put this thing on up here and uh, get that thing latched down. So, okay, we got this put back up. Do you like it? Yeah, do you like it? We asked the people that. We also got this installed fully. We found all the covers. Uh huh. So, I would say the trunk's pretty much done, Chris. Mm -hmm. Looks pretty good. Right. Our objective is to take this thing off the door. And then take this one off the handle. Install it on that handle because this is a black handle versus a tan handle. Chris? So. Chris? That's what we're working Chris. on. Okay, one thing that Chris is gonna do when we pull this thing off, he's gonna clean this thing off. This looks terrible. Isn't that right, Chris? Sure. <laughs> All right. As soon as we take this electronic part out, that's what he's gonna do. Yeah, we probably could just fix this uh, this thing. But the reason why we got a new one, I say new, but uh, these are straight from eBay. But uh, we got them on eBay. Funny story. We ordered a set. We're waiting for him to come in. Waiting for him to come in. Deliver. The person that sold them to us said they were delivered. Looking at the address on the directions he gave us, they were delivered in California. It comes to find out he sold the item twice and didn't realize it. And I'm like, I live in Florida. So, um, got the money back, ordered a new set. And these ones came in time for Christmas. So, 
Chris, you take this inside and wash that, make it look pretty. All right, I'm gonna take this off, take that one off, we get that ready, and I'll be right back. All right, so he cleaned that up. It looks really good. Looks brand new, Chris. Um, and we're getting into the weeds here. Uh, when I got this used one, this thing's cracked, kind of pushing forward. I was able to pull this clip off and put it back on here on the original one. This is the original one. Um, this is the original faceplate, which all the tabs are in contact. This is the used ones. So I took the innards of that one to put in this one. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug this in. Chris? <coughs> I'm going to put this one in and see if it works the windows now um, and go from there. So our original switch works. <clears throat> the switch we got is, is broken. That sucks. Okay, after about 30 minutes of pulling the switches out and switching out tumblers and getting this one moved over to this one that works. Um, <clears throat> let's go try it again and see if it, I broke it or it's working like it should. All right, let's go. Auto works, up where it works. Looks like we'll have to replace the LA switch. I think the motor. The up and down works! What's up, Chris? What you got? I have nothing on that. <laughs> I don't even know what you did. You just like, you replaced like the entire thing from my, my perspective. You just like started tinkering with um, it. Um, yeah, so turn this off. I'll tell you what I got, I did. One second. Okay, Chris, so what I did was these rocker switches, you see these little rockers in here, these things, they actually, when you move the switch, these one goes to connection and one goes other. So these have little rocker switches, okay? So what these do, these are spring-loaded little switches they, they press in, okay? These roll up and push down. What was happening on this one, the reason why we had up but not down was because when these were pushing down the other way it wasn't making good contact so what I did was I switched out the rockers um, these ones look a little corroded so see how they're all burnt on the back side see that well it wasn't making a good connection so I went ahead and swapped it out with uh, the rocker that was in this switch now we have one good switch that works everything clean this all up Put this back together, put that in there, then we're gonna put the door back on. Then Chris is gonna have a working car again. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right, yeah. So, boom. Now that's all put together, let's put it all back in the door card. All right, it's all done. Now it's just time to put it back on the car, put these things back in, do some more cleanup here on this card. But we'll do it in the car after it's all plugged in and stuff. All right. All right, Chris. We got a clean door panel on here. I think this is the cleanest your door panel's ever been. Mm-hmm. And can we just make sure it all works still? All right, Chris, here's the final moment. Let's see what happens. Okay, that's good. Auto works, great. Up works, great. Oh, it works. Johnny, they're looking at it. Okay, good. Up, down. Okay. Still need to fix that up. Door locks. Oh, wait, yeah, that. Turn on the lights, see it works. There we go. Chris. We got it all. Well, thanks guys for watching the video. Until next time, have a great day. Bye. All right, something else to add. I decided this year I want to do some collaborations with other uh, YouTubers. So what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to send out some emails to some local YouTubers, some people you may know. And uh, uh, I'll share any responses if I get anything back. But yeah, I'm very positive. I think uh, we'll get some messages back. And uh, hopefully we'll do some collaborations. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.